Yeah, we actually definitely were uh, satisfied with the uh, the look for prejudging. Um, we uh, were not satisfied with all of the posing mm. that we were getting. Uh, I think I lost it uh, from the back double bicep. And uh, I just need to, you know, I wasn't opening up. I just need to open up uh, even more. I, I don't know why we, we drill it, we drill it, we drill it. And I don't know why I did not open up. But I think that's where the, um, that's where it, it really was the deciding factor on teeter-tottering on which way to go between second and third and myself and Terrence. And then sure enough, at the night show, you know, we hit the back of a bicep. Uh, and then Chris and I kind of get into the little scuffle, the little, little positioning uh, battle. You that, know? Was sad. that was judging. That was all that happened at the judging. Yeah, that happened at the judging, but then at, at, at but then at finals it happened, and then and it was kind of ironic. They move us, they move myself and Terrence it, with that shot, you know, right, with the right. bicep shot. So I'm thinking, I'm like, well, I'm thinking the judges were probably like, uh, we're probably discussing, well, look, if Breon doesn't open up on this shot, mm -hmm. um, you know, here, uh, we're going to we're going to move them. Yeah. I'm just trying to figure out how Terrence got ahead of you. I know he's like the greatest poser in the sport. I, I, you're good, but he's, you know, he's just like, he gives me chills when I watch him. And that, I haven't seen somebody that can do that since like Labrada or Bob Paris. You know, he's, he's phenomenal at that. But I'm trying to think physique wise, how did he get ahead of you? Did he look that much better than he had a few hours before? Did you look that much worse? Was it that one pose? I mean, I'm, I'm trying to wrap my head around it. You really think it came down to just like a, the, the back shots? Yeah. 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 I, I think it came down to that back of a bicep. There was, uh, you know, he, he got me by one point. So, uh, as far as the judging is concerned, you know, that, that, that really splits the judging as far as just like one more judge, um, uh, you know, giving him the nod on a pose, uh, you know, um, and that's, that's, I think that was the, the deciding factor because, uh, when I look at all the poses, I think that, um, you know, I think that I beat Terrence in, and all of the other poses, except for that back double bicep, mm -hmm. except for that double bicep. When I don't, when I, when I'm not opened up and when I'm not, um, when I'm not in, you know, uh, opening up at, at with width right. on my back, then, uh, and Terrence, you know, and Terrence is wider, uh, and he's de pretty developed back there too. Then yeah. I think that, that's, uh, that's where it is. I think I get Terrence on muscularity and I think I get, I think I get him on, uh, Overall mass, you definitely have more carry more mass on your yeah. frame than he does. Definitely, yeah. And more, I, you have a lot. You have a fuller look too, for sure. A rounder look than he does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and uh, I think I get him in in certain areas with crispness and detail and conditioning, especially in the front. Um, but he looks pretty good from the back. He looks pretty good from the back and in that back double bicep. So. Um, that's where I think the uh, I think the deciding factor was there, and the feedback was that I need to open up my back too, you know. 